Hey guys, it's Clint here. You know, in this whole slowing down the mass gatherings and stopping the, the church gatherings and anything big and restaurants started, I knew immediately preachers were going to look for a way to, to live stream it and find a way to take advantage of this digital media. And I told myself, don't you get wrapped up in that stuff. Listen to your heart. Well, I've been listening to my heart and dug him. Daggum, I can't shake it, because here's what I want to tell you. What I felt in my heart from the very beginning, I felt the Lord telling me, now more than ever, you need to be a light in a dark place. And that's not a new thing for me. All my life, different men of God had spoken the word of the Lord over me and told me I was to be a light in a dark place, which I took as a uh, freedom to start going to all the dark places I always wanted to go to like concerts and clubs and shows and, and they just tell my mom and dad oh I'm just going to be a light in a dark place but uh as I've got older I've started to think you know right right now people are frustrated they're they're consumed with their own survival they're consumed with their own uh, health and, and worry and I just want to encourage you all to be a light in a dark place. Uh, in the book of Matthew, chapter 5, verse 14, we're told, You are the light of the world. A city set on a hill cannot be hid. Now, it's real... <sighs> that can get tricky, right? Because here's something I want to explain to you about being light. See, when darkness starts creeping in, we need to remember darkness is not the opposite of light. In order for darkness to be the opposite of light, it has to be equal. Opposites must be equal, and, and darkness is not the opposite of light. It is simply the absence of light. So when you go into these dark places where you feel this heaviness and this anxiety and this selfishness and, and all of these emotions that are just swirling in the environment around you, remember, it's not as powerful as the light that's inside of you. You... It's not your opposite. It's not the equal of the light in you. It's just the place that's had an absence of the light that is inside of you and dying to get out of you. So here's... Be kind. Love your neighbor. Be courteous. Have manners. Be light. Be light. I love you. Take care of yourselves. As my dad always told me, be wise.